Hey guys, what is up? Reese here with another new shoe pickup video. And this is actually the very first pair of Reeboks that I've ever purchased. What we're looking at is the Reebok Shack Gnosis Barracks. This released on August 28th, 2013 for $115. And these pay respect to Shaq's upbringing on a military base because his stepfather was actually in the army. And so as you can see, it's a very subdued military style colorway which is actually kind of interesting for the Shaq Gnosis because generally what you'll see is you've got these different ribbons along here and they'll usually be offset two different colors because when you think of Shaq Gnosis that makes you think hypnosis and when you think of like cartoons and stuff you kind of see a rippling effect with hypnosis and so it's kind of like that back and forth ripple but so this actually completely plays that down and goes with a solid color upper although it is important to note and I'll show this more in the up close part of the video that there actually are two different materials used here, so there is still a little bit of that offset. We're going to close up view going and show you all the materials and everything, but I did want to point out that I have two different colored laces in these shoes. They come with the cargo green laces in the shoe themselves, but they also come with a set of black laces. And I wanted to show you both because you have the option to put both in. I like the cargo green a lot because it ties with that kind of the more subdued army style colorway, but then I also like the black because it provides a little more contrast and ties in stuff like you've got all the logos and stuff and some of the midsole black. So I think you really can't go wrong either way. I'd be interested to hear in the comments which you would put in if you had the pair or if you do have them, which you actually put in. So now let's get our close up view going. Hey guys, here we go with our close up look of the Reebok Shack Gnosis in the Barracks colorway. I want to give you a quick close up view of the two colored laces. Again, you have the cargo green laces here and the black laces here. And honestly, I don't think you can go wrong either way. There's pros and cons to both. I still haven't decided what I'm gonna put in, but I'm guessing what I'll probably end up doing is put a set of laces in there, wear them a couple times, switch out the laces. You know, just have some fun with it, basically. So now let's get into the shoe itself. Basically, your entire upper is cargo green. And like I said earlier, it's actually, it's hard to tell on the video, but I'll take a picture and put it in the video to show you. But what you've got is this section right here, and then this ribbon, this ribbon, and this ribbon are all kind of like a smooth new buck material. But then this ribbon right here, this ribbon, this ribbon, and part of, most of the toe box is actually kind of a textured, slightly different new buck material. And so while they're both the same color, you can actually see a little bit of just a difference between like those two. And so it just adds a little bit of that Shacknosis flair without really taking away from the military styling, which is cool. The tongue is also your cargo green. And you've got the black Shack Dunkman logo right there at the tip of the tongue. You've got some holes for breathability right there. And then up at the top of the tongue, you've got your tongue tag in khaki with a black Reebok logo. If we look at the side here, most of these eyelets are just holes in the shoe, but the top two eyelets are black plastic pieces, which add a nice little look. Coming to the back, we've got again your black Shaq Dunkman logo and a khaki pull tab. The interior of the shoe is basically identical to the exterior in terms of colors and everything. One of the coolest parts of this shoe is the camo lining. I don't know if you can see it that well, but it's got a nice camo look. And I like that because I like these colors, like the military colors, but I'm not a huge fan of a lot of camo. And so this is a nice way to add it to the shoe without it being too overbearing. And if you look at the front of the shoe, the camo actually wraps around right here and right here a little bit. So it still is super visible even when you're wearing the shoes and you know your sock might be covering most of the lining part. The insole itself is black with a, with, it spells out Reebok in the bottom in white. I don't think you can really see that in there. But that does it for the upper. As far as the midsole goes, you got a black midsole. Here you've got a little opening to view the Hexalite cushioning. Wraps around the back here. Pretty much the same thing over here except no opening. And then your outsole is your khaki color. If we look at the out, outside of the shoe here, you've got your Reebok logo and Shaq Dunkman logo in cargo green. You've got a little black piece right here. You've got a couple windows into the hex like cushioning. And then the rest of it is your cargo, or your khaki, excuse me, just traction pattern. Um, it, these are, they say non-marking outsole, so that's cool. I remember having to look for that when I was like in first grade, you know, and I was looking for shoes for PE. But all in all, that's the shoe, the Reebok Shack Gnosis Barracks. I love this shoe. I think it's a really neat looking shoe. 
I'm not a huge fan of like these military colors on shoes generally, but there was something about this pair that I really, really liked. It's kind of an, a subdued version of the Shaq Gnosis, but it still comes out looking really solid. These are still available in most places. I would definitely recommend looking in to pick them up if you like them at all. They're comfortable. They look cool. I've already gotten com comments and I haven't even worn them. I just like had them sitting out in my room. So yeah, thanks for checking this out, guys. Have a great day.